Good evening and welcome to the Daily Market Update. The DSE X ended flat today, marginally gaining 3.85 points or 0.07%, and settled at 5,864 points. Market turnover was 4.44 billion Bangladeshi takas, which is an increase of 6.87% compared to the previous trading day. Renata, Orion Infusion, and Kohinoor Chemicals from the pharmaceutical sector, British American Tobacco and Fu Wang Foods from the food and allied sector, and Central Insurance from the insurance sector. On the other hand, BRAC Bank and Citibank from the banking sector, Khan Brothers PP Woven Bag Industries from the industrial sector, and Intraco Refueling Station from the fuel and power sector mainly dragged the market down today, keeping the market flat. In terms of sector-wise return, the insurance sector posted the highest gain of 2.22%, while the NBFI sector registered the second highest gain of 1.39%. On the other hand, the textile sector posted the highest loss of 0.63% today. Eleven insurance companies were among the top 20 gainers today. Carnafuli Insurance, Deshbandu Polymer, and Syntex Industries registered the highest gain, while Brack Bank, Shepherd Industries, and Katali Textile were the top losers today. There was no disclosed price sense of information for these stocks. The trading volume of Syntex Industries, National Life Insurance and Bank Asia increased significantly today compared to the average trading volume of the last three months. There is no publicly disclosed material reason for the volume increase of these stocks. Top two news today. Private sector credit growth slightly increased to 9.96% in February from 9.95% in January 2024, influenced by factors such as liquidity constraints, diminished lending capacity of banks and prevailing economic difficulties. Additionally, intensified monitoring and import restrictions imposed by the government and the Bangladesh Bank have further constrained business activities, leading to decreased demand for credit. However, the government is trying its best to make the situation better. The Bangladesh Bank has re-established its 2012 loan classification rule, reducing the overdue time for term loans by three months to align with international standards, as mandated by the International Monetary Fund, IMF, as part of a $4.7 billion loan package. Under the new regulation outlined in a Bangladesh Bank circular, term loans will now be considered overdue after three months of non-payment from the fixed repayment expiry date, down from the previous six-month threshold. That's all for today. Thank you.